The student run paper on campus has changed a lot in the last few months. Reporter Kristen Furmage shows us how this institution has been doing since they took the daily out of the daily universe. If you've picked up a paper on campus this semester, you've probably noticed that the daily universe isn't so daily anymore. In fact, now it's just the universe. We stopped printing daily newspapers in the spring. We had started going to the weekly platform, and it's technically we call it the digital first platform, where we have new content up online daily, um, but we only print the edition on Tuesdays. The decision to go digital saves the universe money, and it also helps their journalists prepare for the real world, where many newspapers have a strong online presence. Online newspapers, we are expanding journalism beyond anything that people probably in the past would have thought would happen. We have a lot more including of other people's contributions through social media. We get comments through um, people now can actually see the video we might mention in our article just by clicking the link that is within the article. The Universe webpage has only been live for about a month, but the team is working really hard on some new features to make this site a real hub for students. Bobby Swingler, who designed the new website, has been working very hard this semester to get the sleek, attention-grabbing new face of the Universe up and running. The new website is something that uh, Steve Fidel and I wanted to be kind of a hub here at BYU. Previously, uh, the Universe website was something that was just looking at it. It looked rather outdated. We're trying to find ways to keep students on the website and see what else the site has to offer. So we've added quite a few new features. Along with the news articles, the site has features like an online ride board. That's right, students. You don't have to go to the Wilkinson Center with a pen and paper anymore. Just hop on the Universe website. You can uh, post where you want to go and when you want to go. And, uh, and when anybody interacts with that post, you can receive an email and say, oh, somebody wants to get a ride with me here or needs a ride there. The website will soon be getting something called the Marketplace, a classifieds page where BYU students can gather to buy and sell. We have all sorts of categories for apartments and housing, um, textbook, textbooks, musical instruments, electronics, jobs and internships. We're trying to mimic uh, just a general online classifieds that will be specifically for uh, BYU students. There's also a forum where students can help each other out with schoolwork. On top of all of that, you of course still have all the news that you love and count on from the universe. Like we've got a special one for Police Beat, we have our campus news, we have the special day in the life project, divine comedy, YouTube videos and humor you videos that are right on our website um, by just a click. We have 11 news also that is included on the website. Their stories go there too. So we're just collecting and it's becoming a hub for all of this information that BYU has. Bobby and the team are working on even more to add to the website. So get online and check it out. Kristen Furmage, BYU Weekly.